That's why there's an entire field of statistical analysis. That's why we do empirical. Uh, that's why we rely on. Yeah, okay, if we're going to follow that uh, mindset, you could say statistics says um, Cardi B is way mm -hmm. more famous than Freddie Mercury. Yeah. And statistically, she is more better musically than Freddie mm -hmm. because she has better numbers, right? Yeah. yeah. My ass, she is even close to his <laughs> pink, po uh, what do you say, toenail. Yeah. He's not, she's not even his toenail when it comes to musical capa capabilities. But statistically, Cardi mm. B is way ahead of Freddie Mercury mm. in views and numbers, right? Yeah. So that should mean Cardi B is better than Freddie Mercury yeah. musically, which we know is a lie. I don't know if this comparison makes sense, but I think a doctor probably, you know, kills more people than a plumber because he he can manage to save them sometimes maybe a small mistake is made yeah. or you know whatever but oh, i yeah. would yeah but i would still want a doctor yeah to operate me or, or a surgeon would yeah but you could say a, a, a doctor plumber. is more dangerous yeah. than a plumber yeah but i would still <laughs> want him to make the surgery if i need one hmm. you know or examine me if i'm sick than a yeah. plumber but yeah. the statistics say that the doctor is more pr uh, probable to hurt me or to kill me than the plumber. Yeah. Way, way m much more prone. Ah. Find empirical evidence when we're making decisions. Why? Because we Let's all right carry right a bunch right of personal... Right That's the problem with lefties mentality. They just go by numbers and shit, you know? Mm. They, they discard actual own thinking. You yeah. know what I mean? Like yeah. your own thinking yeah. in reality. Yeah. They discard all of that in favor of numbers and that is laziness they're just laziness uh, and dumb yeah that's dumb. they're relying on other people's numbers and what they call fact and they can just say that oh, i read this uh, yeah la, 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 la. yeah it's it's lazy mm? yeah i don't need to think i just have these statistics here yeah. and that says it all now move on i owned you biases and when we analyze situations we do not have enough scope to grasp the entirety of the situation why are they also like there's a lot of people like this guy they're kind of numb mm. you know like, yeah he feels very numb <laughs> numb we, didn't, we cannot comprehend it with our human brains bro but listen which I is why when it comes to women driving it's a funny point because Drug the truth is different. The truth is the He's exact so opposite. so boring also. Thanks. No, no, listen. Even if I don't first agree with uh, the excuse me guy, he was much more entertaining to watch. He had more energy. <laughs> yeah, you know, it was entertaining. And this he guy had like is, geek energy. Yeah, yeah, this guy is so boring. There's lies, there's damn lies, and there's statistics. I'm sure you've heard that from Mark Twain. That's the first thing. The second thing is that you're, mm -hmm. you're deriving... You're you can deriving, massage, mm -hmm. yeah, you can massage you're numbers, deriving, but... You can drive, you're deriving your truth from an internet. The, the fact that you're going on the internet, finding some study and saying that this is the truth, especially after the age of COVID and all the fucking truth we were told with that garbage. Oh, to sit here, what? What do you mean? And say, oh, the internet said X. I'm sure the internet did. I'm talking about my personal experiences and some people agree with me and some people do not. That is perfectly fine. Don't give a fuck if people agree with me or otherwise. People are listening to me and they're either agreeing with me or I know, but you're not. still wrong and that's the problem. Uh, I disagree with you. Do you want to be right or do you want to keep speaking into a hug box where people agree with you? And then, hug you know, box? Did well, you say that? You, yeah. What is that? Like, yeah. Uh, confirmation. Yeah, hug. Uh, yeah, and Andrew is absolutely the person that needs a, needs a hug box, right? Yeah, right? Yeah. I think it's Hassan Abai, Hassan Abai who needs a Just hug. Just completely devalue empirical mm -hmm. evidence, actuarial sciences. Okay, now the entirety of the insurance industry that relies on making these sorts of calculations to ensure that these quotes yeah, are Yeah, and the insurance possible. industry is a really honest industry. But even that, <laughs> the, the insurance industry is not uh, determining who is the best driver, like technically. Yeah. They're just saying, this many men crashes. Mm. That's all they're saying. Yeah. They're not saying, well, we did a, uh, you know, Examine and, and, and watch every little thing about driving mm. and women drive better. No, that's not what it says. That's just the crashes. But who gives a fuck? There's a bunch of young dudes trying to impress on their friends or, or a girlfriend or whatever. Or they just dumb when they're young. They drive and crash. So what? Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. You don't think women would crash if they drove the same way? Yeah, of course we would. They might crash even worse. Yeah. 
if they drove the same way, like if they were, if they <laughs> wanted to drive recklessly, mm. they would maybe do backflips and shit. You know what I mean? Mm. That's that's not what we're talking about.